Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ48, and welcome back to Going Medieval. And we are having some serious problems with food here. I've only got 12 meals left, although thankfully I am starting to get some food. Um, the farms are taking like forever to grow. Obviously, they're, they're farms. They're going to take a while to grow. Um, I've got multiple people doing farming. Uh, maybe you should get a couple more. Now, you know what? They seem to be, kept, they seem to be doing okay. Um, I, my main concerns today are food. Uh, their mood, food, mood. I knew it rhymed. I just couldn't remember what it was. My, my concerns today are food, mood, defense, and build, building places for them to live. I mean, it's crazy. There's so much to do in this game. I simply do not have enough time. Uh, but that's the mark of a good game, right? You know, like there should be too much to do. That's part of the challenge, you know, uh, B. Yeah, that, that's part of the challenge that there should be too much to do. Uh, you guys gave me some really awesome tips. I've still got stuff out here. I need I need uh, haulers. Oh my god! This. Uh, by the way, um, Robert being having growing, harvesting, and tailoring all be two stars is killing me. And 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 cut plants. I want to have this person do nothing but tailoring, but I can't, uh, especially during this part of the game because I need to have them out there doing their thing. Uh, we, we're gonna need more haulers. We're gonna need more haulers. Let me find out who's useless and put them on hauling. Alright, I've got a hauler now, and, uh, I, I need people to haul. Uh, food reserve stockpiles are low. Yeah, no, no S, Sherlock. Um, what is my cook doing? I always forget who my cook is. Grow hunting mine, cooking, preparing food. Okay, they're doing what they're supposed to be doing. Should I use two cooks? I don't know. Uh, by the way, I am using, uh, clay brick walls on the inside of my base because I want the outside to be as tough as possible. And clay brick walls, well, clay brick walls have the same hit points as limestone, but, um, well, actually they're the same exact thing as limestone. I think the reason I'm using clay brick walls on the inside and limestone on the outside is because, I don't know, no, re no real reason. Uh, I don't want to use, I don't want to use, um, I don't want to use limestone block walls everywhere because I'll run out of limestone like I already have. So, all right, so let's do that. And we will do this. Okay, and then um, the outside wall can't be completed. Uh, let's see what everyone's doing. Mining and digging, that's cool. Gardening, preparing food, hauling, uh, getting resources for construction, hauling, and gardening. All right, that seems pretty good right now on where I want things to be. Uh, we just need to keep a lookout for animals and things to harvest out in the world that can help us with food like this. All right, this is what I'm going to do. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to come over here. We're on, we're on the almost the top level. I'm going to hit hunt. And I'm just going to do this. And now that deer should have a little hunting mark on them. Yep. All right. So I should... Yep. And Roger's now hunting. Cool. All right. So we're doing pretty good. Now, um, I have some mining going on underground. Which is... Here, let's get down here a little bit. Um, I'm mining this way. Because in here, I believe, is going to be... Yep, right there, limestone. All right, so we need to set up some more mining in here. Uh, rocky soil, limestone. Um, limestone. Limestone. Limestone, limestone. All right, that should be pretty good for now. For the time being, food is starting to come back up. The next thing I want to do once food starts coming back up is I want to start making more drink because these guys have not had a drink in like a year. I mean, oh, also people told me that this, um, the, the whole pyre thing is a waste of wood because once the corpses are out here, they'll eventually rot away and you don't, it doesn't really affect them that much. Also, also I came to manage. Okay. And I set up a profile for all, uh, headgear and apparel. Okay. And that is called 50%. All right. And basically what it is, it, I was told that if you're, if you're, if your clothes get below 50%, uh, the people will start getting upset. So what you want to do is you want to have all the clothes that are below 50% be torn down and made into better clothes. All right. So that's what I did for everyone. I made a profile for 50%. I would do the same for armor and weapons. The problem is I can't make the armor and weapons. So I got to be a little bit less, uh, you know, a little bit less uh, all armor. Yeah, just do all armor. Why isn't that being used? Probably don't have anything under fifty percent. Um, I really need to find another farmer. I, I really do. Or I need to find another tailor. Oh, I have some tailors who have a, uh, who have passion. Well, the cook is not going to change. This person is the miner. 
Um, but I could probably put them on tailoring. Uh, yeah, why don't we put you on tailoring? Cooking. Oh, we got another cook? Nah, I don't, I don't want another cook. We'll put you on tailoring. Alright, there we go. Alright, so we ran out of clay, which sucks. So we need to find some clay deposits. Um, what is this? Oh, that's all clay. Cool, I thought this was clay. That's iron. All right, well, that's a that's that's an easy fix right there. Um, just go ahead and, and mine that out, man. Yep, that'll work. All right, let's speed it up. Yeah, we need to get some more clay. We also need to figure out how we're going to build this base out because I need to figure out how people are going to get up there. Uh, by the way, this is going to be bedrooms, hopefully. Hopefully enough bedrooms. We'll have to see how that works. But for now, I'm just trying to get the thing closed in so I can open it up. Because I don't want to open it up. Because if you open it up without a roof, then it causes all kinds of issues with stuff not being inside and, and whatnot. Uh, so what I'll do is... Let's grab this and this. Oh, can this only go so far? How far can it go? I don't know. That's a good question. Alright. Well, I guess we... You know, we could build with wood on the inside. I'm okay with that. Um, so what on the inside? So we need bedrooms up here. So let's um let's start putting down some bedrooms up here. Okay. So let's do this like that. All right. And what do, what do they need in their bedrooms? Is there like a bedroom thing? Um, I don't I don't remember how to get that up. No, that's roofs. There we go. Is there a bedroom? We got kitchen, workshop, library, church church bedroom one wood hay bed or a hay sleeping spot cannot have any other workstation that's it just a bed okay fair enough i'll leave so i'm gonna give them some more room than that though because that just seems kind of i always make my bedrooms a little bit bigger than i need to in these games and i i prefer it that way all right uh so we need to figure out how this bedroom thing is gonna work so i'm thinking all right, so apparently um, they appeared silently, eyes hollow, hair wild, smelling rancid, and de okay, we're being attacked. Uh, bandit thug, fierce forest bandit. Fi okay, all right, fair enough. We're getting attacked right now. My sailors are unhappy and starving. I don't know why this guy won't eat. I've got food. He just refused to eat. Can I force him to eat right now? Can you please eat something? Here, consume. My goodness, what a pain in the ass this guy. I don't know what his deal is. Alright, okay, and he's eating, he's eating, he's eating, and he's done, okay. Um, so now he's just annoyed. <laughs> Alright, so let's go ahead and grab all of our people. Hopefully the, um, the raiders didn't get too much of a head start there. All right, and they are coming in from here. I, I don't have all my walls up or anything, so we're just going to get everyone inside. Okay. Get everyone inside, please. Please get in the walls. Okay. All right, and while they're coming inside, I will grab all of my archers. Archer, 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 archer. And... I'm not sure which side they're going to come in on. So I don't really know where to put my archers. I guess for now, I'll just put them up here. And then you and you will stay down here and protect. Archer, 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 archer. Okay. I've not been doing too much with defense lately, unfortunately. All right, they're coming in. All right. I wonder if I could follow them with my archers. And kind of pelt them as they're going along. Okay, so I think I'm going to meet them right about here. Now, let's see where they're going to go. Those are all my archers, right? Yes, they are. Now, how can they get up there? They can get up there in a few different places. Uh, but they can't get up there until they get within here. And there's the only door. So, that should be okay. Okay, go right there. Now, I've seen people, I just want to say right off the bat, I've seen people make mazes in this game. Uh, you know, where these enemies will just go through mazes and stuff. I'm purposely not going to do that. Because I think they look, they, they look, I don't know. They don't look cool. It's It doesn't really, like I didn't see that medieval times. I don't know. I just, I don't like the look of it. I don't like the play like that. 
So we'll see how things go. All right, and here we go. Well, what are you shooting at him for? He's on the other side of a wall. Shoot at this guy. Okay. All right, and you will follow along. I love I love the way they walk along they walk along my walls here. Because they just get themselves destroyed on spikes. Alright, get him. Okay. Get him. Get him. I don't know what they're doing. I wonder if they don't know where my door is. Alright. This is a good amount of archers. It's like we can one-shot anybody. Alright, this guy looks dangerous. Alright, they're leaving. Nope, don't let him leave. Don't let him leave. Yeah, where are you going, chump? You're going to hell. He's hurt. And he's dead. Alright, cool. Very good, guys. Very proud of you. You guys are legit. You might be annoying when you don't eat and then complain about being, like, you know, <laughs> unhappy. But, hey man, you get the job done when it counts. All right, there we go. Okay, so like I said, um, people are annoyed. Uh, by the way, I cannot get the schedule right on everybody. Like, I've given them four things of leisure. Now, people told me, well, you have to make more um, shrines, and you have to make more backgammon tables for leisure. So I was like, okay, that makes sense, because if there's only one or two places for people to pray or sit at a backgammon table, that's not going to do anything. So I have three backgammon tables and three of each shrine, all right? And then I have them on, like, four units of leisure. And then I have three units open, so if they need leisure at that point, they can have it. So I, I don't know how much better, you know, how much better I could do this. It just doesn't seem to be... Um, working very well. I had to take Austin off and just leave him completely open because he just he wouldn't he wouldn't be happy. So I will work on it as we go along. Um, one of the things I can do is I can give them their own bedrooms, which is what I've got going on up here. Okay, I'm going to put a wall here, a wall here, and then I'm going to connect these. And these bedrooms are going to come all the way around here. There's going to be a bunch of bedrooms up here. How am I going to do that exactly? I don't know. I'll figure it out. We just need them to complete some beds. And I also need to get a roof over this thing. So let's go ahead and... Well, I can't put a roof over it just yet. Because I need to figure out how... Okay, there. That'll work. Um, so I'm thinking there, there. Probably more structure than I need, but who cares? I'd rather have more structure than not enough. And it's symmetrical, which makes me happy. Oh, got a rabbit here. Come on. There we go. Any other animals? Uh, not seeing any. All right. So they're sleeping. Okay. Well, I mean, you know, we got our defenses down, which is really cool. That'd be the thing I'd be most afraid of in one of these games. It's like the enemies coming in, killing you. But I don't know. Seems to be doing okay. And we don't even have our defense set up properly yet. So there's that. All right. So you guys are going to sleep. Let's go ahead and get some mushrooms. And our, our food is just, we're, we're just hanging on by a thread. We really are. I'm going to look and see if there's anything downstairs that can be cooked. Yep, see, right there. Okay, is my cook set up to cook? See, I need to make sure he's just on cooking. All right, when he gets up, he should... I might mean, need two cooks. Honestly, like, I don't... I don't know. I don't know who would be my other cook. I guess it would be this person. But they're my constructor. Well, if they're not constructing, help cook. They were a hauler. But I need that cooking, man. Because he's got a butcher and he's got a cook. So, it's like, it's a lot. Alright, get that rabbit. Why isn't my guy... Is Mr. Ballin my hunter? I think Mr. Ballin is my hunter. So we gotta wait for him to wake up. Yeah, I mean, they didn't even make it to my door. That was pretty legit. Pretty legit. Alright. Uh, I do have research. I guess I might as well spend some of it. I don't know what to spend it on. I guess armor? Weaponry? See, the thing is, um, until I can make armor and weaponry, I can't 
be picky about what my guys use as armor and weaponry. But it's irrelevant because I can't even get like this stuff done. Why isn't why isn't any tailoring being done? That's another. See, it says right here: winter clothes, summer clothes, cap. These are all I have. All of these, but they're all flimsy. So maybe I should set it up to where if they're flimsy, they get taken down. Um, choose what resources are allowed for this product, this mantle. Flimsy to flawless. Um, maybe I, can I can I set it up to do like? F Hold on, let me figure this out. Okay, so I've got this set up. Um, I've got the first set up right. Dismantle items if they're less than fifty percent, and then I set up a second one, right? That is if they're hundred percent and flimsy, get rid of them. So hopefully that'll that'll help. The, it's a real problem that my tailor is also my uh, my my farmer. That's a it's a problem. So I guess you're gonna have to do tailoring. So they're enjoying... Yeah, I need you to do Taylor. Oh, they're my hunter too? Son of a biscuits. Oh, that sucks. What about you? And you're my cook. So my hunter, my cook, and my farmer all are my ta are, all have passion in tailoring. That is a son of a bee. Oh, man, that sucks. Okay. Well, we're going to put you on tailor. Uh, we're going to put you on tailoring as well. If you're not cooking, you need to be tailoring. Here you go. Let's do that, 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 and there we go. Cooking and then tailoring. I know it would have worked before as well, but yeah, we need people to tailor for real. For real. The thing is, um, yeah, okay. I definitely want Robert doing the farming though. And we also need haulers now because now we've got food out on the ground. Um, this person is hauling. This per Is two haulers good enough? What is this person doing? Growing? You know what? Why don't we put you on hauling? Um, if there's nothing to craft. And then I'm thinking one more hauler. Damn. Damn, damn. What are you doing? Mining? I need that mining. Alright, so if there's nothing to... Alright, so you're mining. Wait, you're mining? Because... Uh, why aren't you harvesting? Crops in the wilderness. Yeah, okay. And then we will also do... Yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah, all right, we'll leave, all right, we'll leave that alone. That should work. All right, my cook is doing his cooking duties, but it's just, he just can't keep up. He simply can't keep up. I've, I've now got a decent amount of raw food. He's just not cooking fast enough. And part of the problem is there's no herbs down here. It takes herbs uh, to make, I mean, do I even have herbs? I didn't even look. I'm pretty sure I have herbs. You know what? I didn't even look. Maybe I don't have herbs. Would herbs be under food or raw? Or would it be under this stuff? Mechanical components, coal, wood, sticks, iron, iron, limestone. You know what? I might not have herbs. No, I have herbs. Okay. So what I'm doing is I'm, I, I set it up to keep the herbs down here. So this is where the herbs should come. And there they are. So now, because he was coming all the way up here to get the herbs. And everything else is here. Sticks, food, everything. But the herbs is just killing him. So I did put some other helpers on there. I've got a couple people doing food because... Uh, I'm almost through spring and my food is like not good like at all um, So uh, the farming isn't really the problem. It's just the cooking so All right, I also have some bedrooms up here uh, ready to go. Well, not really ready to go I don't have the roof on there yet, but um, They're working on it. They are working on it. I do have one person who's just construction right here I mean, he's pretty good at construction. That's all I have him doing um, Think of another person on construction, but I don't uh, that's pretty good on construction. What are they doing other than construction? Carpentry? Harvesting? Yeah, they're harvesting stuff. I should probably I should probably leave them on that. Because they're harvesting stuff that's out here in the world. Uh, like and plus I got like stuff not even being hauled back. Look at that. that those mushroom pods are almost gone. Because I don't have enough haulers. Well that's a bit of a problem there. Um you are harvesting. You are praying, preparing food. What is this person doing? More harvesting. You know what? No more harvesting. Just haul. Uh, you're gonna... What are you doing? Crafting? Haul. Um, you are cooking. Yeah, that's my other cook. Okay. Well, you know what? If if the cooking isn't going good, you haul. Because like sometimes you'll have two people trying to work on the same, you know, machine to cook. And that could be a problem. So you want them both to be... You know, if, there, if there's no cooking, then they'll haul. If there's no cooking, then they will... Well, this person's constructing anyway. If there's no construction, they'll cook. If there's no cooking, they'll haul. All right. 
Yeah, it's tough, man. It is tough. I don't see anyone hauling. Uh, tailoring. Well, tailoring is good. Getting resources, enjoying entertainment. Hauling to stockpile. Okay, so we got three people hauling. All right, fair enough. I just don't want that stuff to go bad. Now, do we have people cooking? Yeah, Austin's preparing food. So, what are they doing down here? Oh, that's upstairs. Okay. <laughs> I was like, what's he doing down there? All right, so Austin is now preparing food. Everything's looking okay over here. Um, stuff's getting butchered. Food's getting made. All right, so it's starting to, it's starting to ramp up a little bit. Are lavish meals worth it? Because they take herbs, and I'm, I'm pretty sure they take longer to make. Do you actually get more food for them? It, it doesn't say. I'm, I'm assuming you do. Hoping you do. All right, so we need this roof to be complete. Man, too much construction. That's the problem. I only have one person constructing. Uh, and um, actually, who is my constructor? Construction is Matthew, and they're praying. Say, I gotta get some more construction people. Damn, this is tough, dude. See, I need like everyone to do everything. It's 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 not easy. Um, cook. You know what? If you're not cooking, then construct. I need that roof put on there, man. It's taking forever. I mean, everyone's doing stuff they need to do. By the way, I went to the management tab, uh, or the schedule tab. Oh, hold on. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, you only need seven. Um, I put this on anything because I can't. You guys told me, like, everyone's telling me, like, oh, you need four things of leisure. Oh, I get by on two things of leisure. Um, I'll mess around with this off camera. And kind of see if I can get it right. I don't want to be doing this like all day on camera. It's just, you know, I mean, it's, I'll figure something out and I'll show you what I got and see if we can make it work. I think as people get better, once people, you know, like, look at this. Um, once we get that ugly apparel out of there and once we get desperately thirsty out of there and once we have people like sleeping in their own rooms, we might be able to do less leisure. You know what I mean? So. Okay. Getting resources, hauling, getting resources, hauling. Okay. This is looking pretty good. Um, the lavish meals are starting to be made. All right. You sighted a pale, halting figure near the perimeter of Kilpak. As he approached, it became clear that Edward has been bleeding. Okay, so this guy uh, wants to join. And I can't see his perks, unfortunately. Uh, he's got a good tailoring skill, although he's, he's not. he doesn't have a passion for it. Although construction and culinary... Passion. Um, so decided to join and welcome him to Kill Pack. Yes. Okay, so we need to take a look at this dude. Uh, jobs. And there we go. Just put that on one. And we will just let him kind of do his thing. Um, someone, I should have someone taking care of him. Oh, by the way, I made another, uh, I made another limestone hearth down here and set it up for um, regular meals. Uh, cabbage, beets, raw meat, um, smoked meat. I don't have any of that yet. Um, oh, can you actually use rotten meat and vegetable rot? Uh, it's kind of weird. I don't know how you would use that, but if, if I can use it, why not? All right, yeah, these guys, yeah, we, we need to do some freaking work here, man. For reals. Okay. So, again, the meals are just sitting at 16. That's not really gaining anything. We have a lot of stuff. Um, we better have a couple people preparing food. That's all I got to say. So we got two people preparing food. And I mean, if that's not enough, then I don't know what the hell else to do. Uh, we need people hauling because a lot of this stuff is up here and they might be coming up here to get it. Right. So I think we need maybe some more haulers. Uh, we'll set this dude up as a hauler for the time being. Um, what are you doing? You're cooking. You're cooking and then hauling. Um, you are hunting. You know what? We really don't need him to hunt that much because we have what we need. So I'm going to put him on hauling. I mean, we just need people hauling at this point. What are you doing? Yeah, you're gardening. Yeah. All right, cool. Yeah, I mean, we've got a ton of raw food now. Now we just need to cook it. So, I mean, it's kind of risky not hunting, but it's all right. Um, I need those, uh, what are they called? Red currant shrubs to be done. Uh, we still got another two days on those and six days on the freaking barley. I think we need to expand these stuff, these things that make drink like quite a bit in order to make them work. All right. All right. So that's looking good. 
and we will just leave this on fast speed for now and see what we can get done here. Edward, uh, I should have some, um, yeah, herbs up there, so that's good. Um, settle when you're tending. Yeah, I think we're okay. I think we're okay. Let's skip some time here. So here's the question I have. Should I make my great hall underground? I think I might do that. It just, it just makes sense. Expand zone. Here we go. Yeah, I'm thinking I want to make it underground because that's where my food is going to be. Um, it doesn't make sense to have the food anywhere but underground, so that's what I'm going to do. Also, I really want to know, um, I've done some Google on it, some Google foo. I can't find any research about lavish meals. Maybe it's in the, maybe it's in the game somewhere. Um, I'll continue to do some research on it, but what's the bonus of lavish meals? That's what I want to know, because they, they take a, I don't think it tells you how long it takes to make them, but I'm pretty sure it takes more, a lot more time to make them than regular meals. Cause look how much regular meals I can get done, you know? So it's kind of what I'm wondering. All right. What's the temperature in here? I haven't looked at the temperature in this room in a while. Um, <laughs> honestly, I forget how to do it. All right. Well, let's take a look. All right. So, um, yeah, I really don't remember how to do it. Uh, show overlay of room detection. There we go. Uh, room temperature, ooh, 43 degrees. Floor, floor isolation. Hmm, it looks like the floor is not that good. Maybe I should do some brick floors like you guys were saying. Um, well, let's see. What kind of floor is this? Um, floor. Uh, limestone floor block. Again, the thermal insulation says it's exactly the same. But I'm going to do it anyway, because I'm thinking that's not really true. Okay, I'll do it like this. There we go. All right. And they are mining out under there, so that's looking good. I haven't done any research in a while. Honestly, I really haven't had, like, the... I really haven't wanted to spend research. I guess I could spend some on armor. Why not? There we go. And let's do um, wooden weaponry. Fletching. Um, I don't know what decorative banners do. Do they actually make your people happier? It doesn't say if they do. So, um, wooden weaponry. Fletching too. There we go. All right, I should probably get some people on researching. I will uh, by next video. Oh, look at this. That is ripe. Harvest it. There we go. Harvest that. Cool. Um, these should be just about done, too. Alright, so some of these are ripe. So, Robert, you need to get over there and take care of those. I need to make some freaking wine. And the food, the food's starting to pick back up. I gotta, I'm just gonna make so much freaking food, so I'm gonna be funny. Although I'm starting to run a little bit low on stuff, but... Um, herbs are ripe. That won't really do me any good. Um, cabbage, okay, we got a lot of ripe stuff. So, harvest crops from... Cra yeah, we need more, we need more people to harvest. So let me see who I would like to get the harvest. All right, so more people should be up here harvesting pretty soon. Um, harvesting resources. What are you harvesting? Oh, I see. Yeah, because of the other stuff I set up. Um, getting resources, hauling the stockpile, harvesting resources. There we go. And I put one more person on harvesting. Yeah, okay, great. Harvesting. Um, harvesting. You're hungry. Okay, we got to keep it on the second person. Yeah, that stuff needs to get harvested. We, I want food. I want, like, a million food before winter. Because, like, my guy's almost starving. I mean, I made it through winter, but it was close. A lot closer than I want it to be. We might want to do some more hunting. Do we even need to hunt? I mean, is there any... Like, what's the bonus of meat? Like, can't I just make all the meals with stuff I can grow in my farms? Why even hunt? Harvest ruined. That's not good. <laughs> That's all right. Um, linen cloth pile, okay. Alright, so everyone's doing their thing. And let's come up here. Alright, so I only have one person constructing. I believe. Yep. You are constructing. Is there anyone else that's really good? Well, this person's good at constructing. They're preparing food. You want to do some construction? Yeah, do some construction. I kind of want that construction to get done. Because I want to build more, but it's just like... I've got 50 other things I need my people to do... So, there's not much construction going on. You know what I mean? 
Okay. So it seems like people are starting to go to sleep. All right. Very good. It's nighttime. Time to, time to take a nap. Okay, we got a heat wave. And it's going to affect our crops pretty badly. So, um, we need to harvest the crops ASAP. So, I'm going to put everyone on harvest. The hell of it. I don't want to lose these crops, man. I worked so freaking hard to get them going. There we go. Um, most of them should harvest. But they gotta get they gotta go to sleep first, probably. Oh boy. He works so hard for the crops and this stupid heat wave comes in and just wipes them out. Uh, my raw food is getting pretty low. So I could probably take some of those cooks off, or what I should do is I should hunt animals. I don't know if I want to come out here just for like some shrubbery, but animals will definitely be worth it. There we go. And I did that I did that like thing where I like scroll around the whole map to set up to hunt animals, but I don't know. Sometimes I like doing it this way better. So yeah, there we go. That guy's already ready to be hunted. Our hunter's not like set up to hunt, but he's gonna be set up to hunt in a minute. Okay, so who is our hunter? Harvest, mine, hunt. This guy. All right. So what are you doing? Mining? That's all right. You can hunt now. All right. Go for it. Everyone's sleeping. Just got to wake up in the morning, do some hunting. And uh, we'll hunt while the crops are, you know, being taken care of. Um, we still have herbs that are ripe and some flax. Yeah, ripening. Okay. Yeah, that's a heat wave. All right. Can we, um, like, turn all these off? Will someone turn those off? I think I need someone to be, um, a steward to turn those off. Alright, fine. Let's make you a steward. Yep, excessive heat. I, I knew it. I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to do about that. I guess they could go inside. But we'll, we'll see what happens. Gotta take care of these crops. I don't know what everyone else is doing. Yep, harvesting. Okay, there we go. Everyone's going to be harvesting. Get these crops harvested. Get stupid-ass heat wave. And my my hunt... Is my guy hunting? He's not, because there's... No, he should be hunting. That's before harvesting. I don't know why he's hauling and not hunting. This this guy, I've had problems with this guy hunting before. Now he's hunting. Okay, maybe I just need to wait some, wait a little bit. Yep, harvest ruined. That might not be because of heat wave. That could have been because of talentless hacks. <laughs> oh, boy. Is the roof done? Nope, not yet. Close to being done. Once the roof is done, I'll put a... I'll, um, I'll work on this building a little bit more. It just takes so long for stuff to get. Settlers are unconscious. Settlers wouldn't be tending. Oh, my God. Look at them all. Okay, hold on. Now, what could I do to make them stay inside? Do I just... Uh, do I just need to, um, make, like, like, uh, draft them and then put them inside? I guess. You know what? Might as well put them down here. Hey, right, guys, everybody come inside. Half, most of them are unconscious. I don't know if, um, there's something, I, yeah, they're all unconscious. All right, well, hopefully they'll wake up. All right, all my settlers were about to die, so I just reloaded, and then I brought them all down into the underground area, and I locked the door, and then I set them up to where they could do whatever they want. So, um, you know, they'll be able to do whatever they want over here. They're going to be upset. They're going to be exhausted. I can only go upstairs during... I can only go above, like, during the day, or during the night, although it seems to be uh, dropping. Maybe the heat wave's just about over. I'm not really sure. It's pretty cool that you can lock the door and keep them in here and then get... Because what I had to do in order to get them in here, I had to put them on um, draft and then I had to bring them in here. By the way, they wouldn't sleep during the night either. I guess they couldn't sleep because it was too hot. I have no idea. Um, so they're just kind of passing out down here. And um, the heat wave has ended. Beautiful. All right. So we put that back on default. No one's awake. Uh, sleeping, sleeping. Yep, they're all sleeping. Which is fine. They'll get up, they'll open the door, and they'll be able to go back up top. And then we'll have to assess the food damage. Um, which really sucks. 
but we'll see how things go. All right, guys, wake up. Wake up. Let's go, man. Damn, they're really tired. I I, I brought them upstairs uh, like during the night, and I, I told them, here, oh, I know why they're sleeping. Duh. <laughs> because of this. <laughs> oh, my God. All right, let me fix this. All right, guys, got me a little concerned. They're coming in with two trebuchets. I'm not really... I don't think my defense is up to snuff right now, to be perfectly honest. Um, but, you know, I'm just trying to survive here, man. I'm just trying to deal with the food situation. Um, okay, well, it is what it is. Let's go ahead and grab everyone. All right, that's almost everyone. We'll take Edward, too. All right, and let's get them all into position. We know the drill. I will, um, hopefully not any problem with the trebuchet, but I don't know. I'm not really sure if there's some kind of defense that is really good against the trebuchet. I mean, I'll just shoot with all my archers and hope for the best. All right. Archer, 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 archer. Okay. You guys all get up there, please. All right. And then my two non-archers. Austin... And I don't know how to say that name. <laughs> you will guard the door. Alright, what are you? Oh crap, Edward doesn't have anything. Um, do I have a bow for Edward? I totally forgot about Edward. Sorry, Edward. Oh boy, I got a lot of weapons here. Um, but I'm not seeing any bows. Doesn't mean there's not any bows, it just means I'm not seeing them. He's not like, oh, there's a bow. Alright, you know what? Instead of doing that, why don't we just go to manage? And give him ranged and profile 50%, profile 50%, all armor. I probably should have this set up a little bit better. And then I think we got to take him off and let him do it, let him go get stuff. Okay, he's getting, he's getting all his gear on. All right, they're coming in. He's got a dope helmet. I don't know where the hell he's going now. Um, getting resources for construction. What the hell are you getting resources for construction for? Get damn bow, bro. Equip the bow. Dumbass. <laughs> okay. Alright, now get up on that wall. Get on that wall! There we go. You need me on that wall. You want me on that wall. Uh, Alright. Oh, they look pretty fast, don't they? Where's the trebuchets? Are the trebuchets just people, like, carrying stuff? Or are the trebuchets, like, big-ass trebuchets? Because I'm not seeing anything that looks like a trebuchet. Oh, uh, what is this guy? Stats doesn't say. He's got a big-ass big club in his hand. I don't know. Maybe I'm just missing it. All right, well, it is what it is. Go ahead and grab all you guys. And you're going to move over here. Oh, I'm on fast speed. That's why. I was like, why are they so fast? All right, you. Dead. Okay. Uh, hit him next, please. Come on. He's got some kind of defense going on or something. I appreciate that. Yeah, that's right. You guys go over there and hit all my... Um... All right, let's get this guy. Yeah, hit all my pyres. That's great. You guys said the pyres are a waste of wood? I don't think so. All right, this guy's hurt. Come on, finish him. All right. And let's get this guy next. Okay, uh, get him. Come on, finish him. Okay, and they are running away now. Uh, let's get this guy, see if we can kill him on his way out. Eh, whatever. There, we'll kill him. Yeah, you're fine. You're fine. You guys can go. Oh, or not. All right, cool. Good job, guys. Good job. And I will take all of this. Come on. There we go. Nope, that's not working. There we go. Okay. 
Get out of the way. They're all running over here. I'm trying to... Yeah, they're all going to come over here. All right, fine. There we go. Yeah, they're repairing the wall. Good job. Good job. Now get the hell out of there so I can deal with this. Okay. Now let's make a couple more funeral pyres because I do love those things. I mean, they really do help, guys. Like, people go over and attack them. I mean, even if I didn't need them, I would make them just as a distraction. Uh, where are they? Here we go. I'm just going to make like five of them. Or four. Okay. And people are going back. So, um, I have my hunter. I had my hunter out hunting. But I don't know where any of the food is. Uh, where is... Does he have any carcasses? I'm not seeing any. Alright. He must have uh, not gotten anything yet. Alright, cool. Uh, yeah. We need more people doing this plant thing, too. Like, it's just... It's not gonna work with just one person. So we need grow and harvest. Um, or at least harvest. Who's good at harvesting? Eleven... Four, seven, one, one, two, nine. Okay. All right, you will harvest. Okay. All right. Well, guys, I do think I'm going to have to call this one eventually, man. I wish I could just play this game all freaking day, but unfortunately for me, I cannot. So I am going to call this one here. If you haven't enjoyed the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then... Take it easy. And I just realized I built the limestone wall half proper limestone and half crappy limestone. So I'm going to have to... Oh, that was built from a while ago. That's right. I forgot about that. Not really a huge deal. All right, guys. I'll see you next time.